Hello everyone. Well, I've got a hot cup of tea, and I'm ready to play Cold Fear. Lower deck, I don't even remember what the hell I was doing. Here's what was I? Room. Good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My father works on. Yeah, I've already done that. Alright, so skip that. Okay, Hanson, here's the plan. You find the code... Mm hmm Okay, this is where I was, right? Yeah. I've also turned up the sensitivity. Oh. Wow, I just realized one of the reasons it's so hard to aim. Yeah, that's one of the reasons it's so hard to aim. I didn't realize that until now. Alright, well, there's two big things going on with the aiming. Or maybe there's three. One is that the sensitivity was too low. Now it's higher, so it's better. Another problem is that the boat is constantly moving. So where you're actually aiming is always shifting. That, well, you know, that just comes with the territory, of course. But... The third reason that I just realized right now is that this game actually has negative mouse acceleration. There's only one other game I've ever played that has that, and that's the Arma series. Yeah, the Arma series has that, and it's really obnoxious, and I just realized this game has it too. In other words, the faster you move the mouse, it actually acts against you. It actually makes it slower. Like, look, this is me moving my mouse very slowly. Nice and slow and calm. And if I move it really fast, this is what it does. Slow, fast. Slow, fast. That, that explains everything. Now I know why it's so hard to hit stuff. Because it doesn't respond as you'd think it would. Hmm. Anyway, what am I even doing? Captain Lubinsky. In the cold room. I have to find him! And with Anna's code, I'll be able to open the other door to the rear deck. Oh, that's... Thank you for the explanation. The other door. I know that one. It's not that door, but the other one. No, actually, I think I might actually know what code that's for. I mean, what door that's for. Um... In a cold room... Where are the cold rooms? I don't even know where that is. I think it might be the body that I saw in one of those rooms that had those... those large, like, cryopreservation-looking thingamabobbers. Uh, am I leaving the trails of blood? Are those my footsteps? They are. Okay, can someone explain to me why I have... Can someone explain to me why I secrete blood from my shoes? I mean, I get that when you step in blood, you kind of track it around, but... You don't normally track it around forever. Oh, actually, you don't track it around forever. It actually stops. Is it actually so responsive that it actually only starts when you step over blood? Let's try it. Here's some blood. Wow! I'm surprised they actually put such a fine detail in. I mean, I think it tracks it for way too long. Like, it should disappear much sooner and start to fade out before it does, but still. I'm actually genuinely surprised there's that much attention to detail. To think. Some person actually worked on that. Something like eight years, or eight plus years ago, since this game came out in 2005. Somebody actually worked on that. They worked on the blood effects. Tracking around with your feet. Whoever you were. Sir or ma'am, or madam, or I, I don't know. A human being. I salute you. Your work has gone unrecognized, and that's a shame. I know almost nobody's noticed this, but I have. I've noticed it. I know. I can appreciate your work, okay? I've seen what you did. I see it. It tracks blood after you step in the pool. I get it. Who 
Great, it's locked. Damn it. Mm, that's where it just came from. I can't see shit. Where does this go? And where's the cold room? Wait a minute, I think I know where the cold room is. Okay, I hear you. I'm not gonna come down if there's gonna be a screamy zombie down there. Except I can't see. There we go. Oh, you're not actually dead dead. Oh no, no you are. I thought your head hadn't exploded yet. Okay. Uh, I need to go downstairs into the water. I think. Crew quarters. Mm -hmm. I really don't remember where the downstairs is. I know this is the captain's... Yeah, captain's blah blah blah. The captain's existential area. I have no idea where this goes. Hmm. This doesn't seem like the right spot. Oh, Jesus. Actually, it is the right spot. That was totally unfair, man. Uncalled for. Not cool. Actually, yeah, it wasn't cool. It was hot. No, seriously, it burned. Jesus Christ. I think I'm gonna need to put some ointment on that. And go. Yep, port side cold rooms. Alright. Warmer, 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 warmer. <gasps> Colder. Wait. Is this the right area? Where do I go from here? Is it here? Knetubinar. The damn thing's stuck. Damn it. You know, I'm feeling a bit cold. No, I'll just I'll just tough it out. I don't think those doors open. Where did I? I don't remember where I went to get to the cold rooms. I mean, I got the key by going in there, and I believe nothing else. Yeah, I don't freaking know. I don't know, but I'm going out this way. <laughs> I think this... Well, I was going to say I think that would take me outside. Maybe it won't. Is this the one? No, shit. Okay. In that case, I think the door that would take me outside is now locked. Because I'm pretty sure that was unlocked before. Yeah, okay, I have no clue. I don't think it's down there. I can't open any of the doors except the one that takes me to places where I can't go anywhere that I want to go. That's the med bay. Those are just piddly little side rooms, so I gotta go here.
Ooh, bouncy lights. Oh, hi. Oh, come on, you're ruining the moment. I want you to appreciate the lights. And you have to come in here, swinging your goddamn sword around. I mean knife. Eh, no, that qualifies as a sword. At least in my mind it does. Right, cruise quarters. And captain's bl uh, uh, What do you call it? Captain's... Quarters. That's the word. That goes up to the radio room. Alright, what's here? Well, that's not good. I don't think they can come at me because the ship is too angled. There we go, now they can. Right. Looks like stuff's getting worse. The weather's getting worse. I thought I blew up your head. No, maybe you're one of the ones that I spared. Alright. Well, I will honor my previous decision. It is still in effect. Oh my god, I lost my balance. It's okay, I have strong upper arms. It's from all that jacking off. While looking in a mirror and looking at my own face. God, I'm so pretty. Run! Did it work? Yeah, it worked. Mm, but your head's not exploded. There we go. Now I feel safe. Right. Do I need to go somewhere down here? There's enemies, so I'm assuming that's a yes. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Ow. Look at my graceful elegance. Even while falling, I'm elegant. Oh god. Okay. I've been in there. Yeah, I've been in there. That's a dead end. I believe this is a dead end, too. Let's try it. Yeah, it is. So, that only leaves one spot. Over here. Yeah, and there's a door over here to the right. Here we go. Okay, here battle music. There must be enemies. I'm pretty sure these hurt you if you touch them, right? <laughs> yeah! Oh no, this thing hit me! At 0 0.5 miles per hour. Oh, my head! Ow! Oh, I'm gonna have a headache. My forehead will be slightly irritated for hours. Oh, it hurts so bad. <gasps> I need to take ibuprofen. The pain, the pain. <sighs> That's gonna sting. I'm gonna have bruises for seconds. Now that might actually cause a bruise. And maybe a death. Or two. Or three. Ooh, can they get hit? Yes, they can. Right, that's not good. I'm gonna go up the stairs, okay? Great. 
That didn't work too good. Right, everybody needs to die. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. I ran out of ammo and didn't even realize it. I couldn't really tell because when you press reload, it doesn't make a sound. And when you try to shoot, it makes the faintest of clicky noises. It's like click, 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 click. Right, I'm actually extremely low on ammo. So the other door I think that might open would be this one. It's unlocked. Excellent. Please go before you get hit in the back of the head. Thank you. Ew. Ew. Okay, kudos for the monster design on those and, and their behavior. They're very strange and actually really creepy. Whoops, shit. Like, I'm actually really, really impressed. With how good they look. Seriously impressed. Somebody put a lot of work into how they behave. And it shows. Anything else down there? No, just a door. Okay, I'm safe. What does this note say? A note about the pumping station. Attention, maintenance crew. A maintenance works on the pumping system scheduled for December 14th has been moved back to December 18th due to delays in getting replacement filters. Since the risk of flooding is increased, you are advised against storing any munitions or weapons in rooms whose doors can be blocked by pressure. Alright. Nope, that didn't really tell me anything important. Hmm. I wonder what this is going to do. I'm guessing it's going to make the red light green. Port Katopoa Hakok. Prow Hakok. Napaboptabum Hakok. Kopmika Hakok. Hmm. And I could either set this to Ha or Katun. Let's set it to Ha. I'm feeling in a humorous mood. Oh, now I can go to the cold storage. Okay. But wait a minute, where does this go? It's unlocked. Is this a shortcut? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Actually, maybe it is. Oh yeah, it's one of the doors I tried to enter. Go away, you little fucker. Fuck off. This will take me to where? I think this is upstairs, right? Rear deck. Is that where I want to go? I don't even know. Oh, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Can I remember how to get there? Yes. Speed run. What the hell? Stuck. Are you serious? <sighs> All right, can I go this way? Damn thing's locked from the other side. What the f okay? How do I get there, then? I 
I just came from there. Uh. Ow. It hit me in the head right before I go in. Thanks. I mean... I'll try another way down below, I guess. I, I have no idea how to get there now. Absolutely none. I thought you were dead. You're just a bunch of ammo sinks, aren't you? I can't even really kill you. Just keep popping up, you, popping up, you little fuckers. Yeah, I don't think this is going to take me where I need to go. I, I don't know. Let's just go. Oh, I hear you. One of those little things again. Oh, great. Alright, you know what? I want to test this thing out. Oh god, sup? View? View? Calm down, view. Okay, it doesn't actually kill them, right? It just distracts them. Ew, it's like sucking on it. Yeah, okay, it distracts them for like a second. Oh, wonderful. Right, so... This is the cold storage that I was originally thinking of, which is not the right one. Yeah, this is engine room access, apparently. But there's actually a med kit in here, so I might as well grab that. Whoa, wait a minute. Maybe this is where I need to go? I do want to save. Actually, I would like to just not even go through this door. But I don't think I can stop that, so... I guess I will save. The medkit's back there in the other door, but... I shall leave it. Farewell, medkit. Farewell. Get ready. What? They're too close! What? Open fire! Right. I'm going to let all of you deal with that, and I'm going to hang back here. That did literally nothing. You're making your way over here slowly, I don't like that. Yeah, fuck off. Ooh, if I had an explosive... Oh, I could have done that and then done the barrel. Actually, I still can. Hold on. There we go. And my last pistol shot. Nice. Ow. Oh shit. Okay, I have literally no ammo. This, this is gonna be a little bit of a problem. Ow. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. I think I had to hit that to do something. And I had no ammo, so I had to melee it. And, uh, yeah, that happened. Whoopsie. Okay, let's save ammo this time. Mm hmm Alright, go over there. Do I even need to do that? I can't seem to hit the key. Oh, that did some... What is... What does that do? Come on. Hit him. Get him. 
Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh, no. The other one's up. They're twitching. They're twitching. Oh, no. I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. Alright. Just die. Right. I'm back to no ammo. Here we go. Whew. Um, okay, hold on. The med bay is right up here. I, Where's the armory, though? I know it's nearby, too, but I don't remember exactly where. Four side cold rooms. All right, I know the med bay's in here. But I still need to find the armorarium. <sighs> Where is that thing? That was the armory, wasn't it? The thing that blew up. Well, fuck me. Wait a minute. Is that a note? Oh. A note about electrical boxes. I think it's a bit too late. I thought it was just litter on the ground. Misplaces electrical... Uh, actually, this might be important. According to witnesses, Corporal Legay... Legay? Had misplaced his electronic key while on duty. Unable to reach his official post, he promptly fired at the electrical control box on door 114, causing it to explode. Exposed live wiring subsequently came into contact with a pool of water on the floor. The door opened. However, Corporal Legay was electrocuted. No follow-up necessary. These are the dumbest people in the world! Oh my god! He misplaced his electronic key, so he fired at the electrical control box. Good job, Lagai. Good job, you fucking idiot. Dear god. Why am I even here to save these people? Tell me. Why should I save anyone? These people should be... Destroyed for the betterment of mankind. Kill them. Nuke this ship. Everybody will be better for it. I just realized I didn't even need to kill anything in there, did I? I was just going to leave the room. Why did I even bother? Mm. Anyway. This is blocked, right? Oh no. It looked all lumpy. I thought maybe it was messed up. Anyway, yeah, there's not going to be any ammo there. Alright. Time to venture into new territories. And I believe I'm going to get very intimate with my E key. What's in door number one? That's not good. Can I kill them with melee? Whoa, what the fuck? I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> I don't even know this does damage. Man, look at how active my view is. Oh, it does. Okay, I need ammo. Right now. That looks like a letter. That's great, but that's not ammo. I can't fire that. Can I put a letter in my gun? No, I can't. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I'm just peering to the side while I'm bashing him in the face. No, I don't see any ammo here. I'm just going to leave. Okay, I found the captain. He's a corpsicle. Anyone got any bright ideas? 
Search the body. You've got experience with that, right? He's a corpsicle. How very respectful. Oh god. I think he just made a noise. Yeah, um... Play oh, fuck. Does anyone have ammo? No, no. I don't want the captain's quarters key. What did I just pick up? A note about mutations. That's wonderful. That's not what I want. No, don't hit the f I, just, I just hit the corpsicle. I'm gonna- oh god, I'm gonna leave. Nothing on the frozen stiff except the keys to his quarters. I'll head there next. If the codes for the autopilot aren't on him, that's the best place to look. Just don't rush over there and get yourself killed. Thanks for the tip. Yeah. Mr. Maximilian, or John, or Bob, whatever the hell your name is, my main character. You you just told that guy that you searched his body, except you didn't. You searched the floor around him. You never actually searched his body. You're a liar. You're a pathological liar, Maximilian. I need another medkit. I am not going to die before I find ammo. You know what? Maybe I am. You're kind of in the med bay door. Could you please leave? There we go. Goodbye. He sounds like... Whoa. Holy crap. Whoa. You know, I thought when I was going in here, I was actually going into a new level, but apparently I'm not. I'm actually in the same level, obviously, because he's actually there. Okay. Ooh, they're fast. Okay. Captain's quarters. I can do that. Maybe. I think. I've gotten there accidentally many times before. Hopefully I can find it when I'm actually specifically looking for it. How do I do it? I can't go that way. That door's locked now. Uh, you know what? Let me search for ammo in these side rooms. Why is this so dark? Oh, Jesus. It is literally pitch black. Ugh, I don't like it. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna leave now. Oh, the kissing rats are gone. Nope. You know what? I have some new notes that I haven't read yet. Antidote. Hmm, might be important. Gentlemen, I am delighted to inform you that Dr. Bakarev has succeeded in producing an effective antidote, provided it is administered soon after infestation begins. Indeed, it only works if a tendril has not reached the victim's brain. According to Dr. Bakarev, the antidote encourages the secretion of a particular enzyme along the spinal column that is lethal to the exocell. However, once the tendril gets into the victim's brain, the antidote is powerless. In parallel, Dr. Kampsky is, reaching, is researching how to limit the exocell's growth, and thus block the tendril's development. Dr. Kamsky has assured me that there will be significant results in the next three months provided he receives new specimens. Mutations! Oh dear god. Do I want to read this? Not really. 
Normally I read every note in a game, but in this case, because of the kind of game it is, I don't really care. Um, I'll skim it. Mutation effects begin almost immediately upon infection. The first clinical signs of mutagenic change occur from within three minutes to just over two hours. With the average effects occurring after 26 minutes. Mm-hmm. One third of all subjects demonstrated an additional form of mutation. These specimens develop tendrils mainly on the upper chest. Mm-hmm. So, in other words, special enemies. Okay. Gotcha. Right. Um, where, where am I going? Oh, yeah, this way. Wait. Where am I going? I mean, this is all locked, right? Oh, no, the side door's not locked. Okay. No, no, I just went... What the fuck? Yeah, I've been in there. And this is still locked. This door ain't opening. I ain't gonna open that door. Oh god. Fuck. I don't... What the hell did I even just do? Oh, I went into Anna's room. Right. Jesus. Where do I need to go? I need to make my decision pretty quickly. Let's go to the danger room. Oh! Oh! Is that ammo? Ammo. 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 You know, I'm not even going to waste it on these guys. I'm going to save it. Okay, now I can actually do something. Jesus. And I can go get the medkit. Okay, the, what the hell? I'm guessing that I'm not getting the medkit. The door looks like it's not doing too great. The damn thing's stuck. Oh, who would have thought? It looks like a perfectly functioning door, pristine. I would buy that door. I seriously don't know how to get. Why where am I even trying to get to? I forgot. Oh, yeah, Captain's Quarters. Okay. I don't. I guess I'm taking a roundabout way. Maybe. Oh, yeah, you things again. Fuck. Go away, go away. I don't want to waste my ammo on you. This is propeller shaft room. I don't think there's anything useful in there. Let me check, but... I think I'm going to end up going upstairs. Yeah, I don't think so. Nope. Awkward silence. Oh, come on, you weren't there before. You change positions, you cheaters. Hackers. Hmm. Hmm. Propeller shaft. That's just another door to the same place. And where does this go again? Pump control room. I'll take it. Okay. Should be able to make my way from here. I think. Shit, where do I go? I know if I go around the side, there's going to be nowhere to enter. It's all blocked off. Wasn't I just here? Ah. 
I don't even know anymore. I was just here. Oh, fuck. I was just here. How the fuck? How? How do I get where I need to go? I don't think this is going to take me where I need to go. I could at least shoot the enemies in here. Potentially getting more ammo. If I'm careful with my shots, I might gain ammo. Like, I, I don't even know. But let's go in here and let's shoot. Oh, 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 calm down. Calm down, sir. Calm down. There's no need to be angry. Okay. I used about seven shots, or I think, yeah. Pistol ammo. Okay, cool. Okay. That makes up for it. I'm good. Ooh. Wait. Oh, yeah, I do have a shotgun. I totally forgot about, forgot about my shotgun. In fact, I might have had ammo for it the whole time. I think I did. It was only a little bit, though. Hmm, what does that do? That didn't help. And let's go in here. Time to ammo farm. There we go. Pistol ammo, yay, my least favorite weapon. Right, well at least I'm combat effective again, that's nice. Now where do I go from here? The damn thing's stuck. Damn it. I think I'm going in circles at this point. Yeah, I mean, you go down here, and then you go to the side rooms, and, and he's all... Maximilian's all like, oh my god, they're stuck. The damn thing's stuck. The damn thing's stuck. Yeah. Nothing doing. Which is a phrase that almost nobody says. Because it sounds weird. The damn thing's stuck. Damn it. Upstairs, I guess. Oh god. Okay, calm calm down, sir. Calm did you just kick me in the face, sir? That is very rude. Have you learned your lesson, sir? Nope. Yeah, that feels good. Hmm. Hmm. This way? I don't freaking know. I think it was effective. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was really effective. Have I been in here before? No, because actually they just knocked down the door. But there's nothing in there but blood. And broken dreams. 
And I can't load my gun with broken dreams. As much as I'd like to. I'm pretty sure I've been here before. I don't... Where the fuck am I going? No, this is it! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! Okay. Ah, oh, thank god. Fuck you. It's unlocked. Hmm. It's actually really pretty looking. Oh, that's the exit door that goes off the side of the ship. The other door. There's something strange about this clock. It doesn't move. It must be the virus. It's infected. There we go. I put it down. For the betterment of mankind. Rest in pieces, clock. It's a shame I can't read. To unlock the autopilot. Go ahead. Three, te, five, L. Got that? It's working. I'm putting in the coordinates for the drilling platform now. Whoa, Anna, getting a little rough there. Hang on, I'll meet you at the pilot house. No, it's not safe. Look, the seas are too rough for us to dock with the oil rig, yes? What are you getting at? The only way we can get on board is to climb up to the crow's nest and then jump when we get close. Oh, crap. We're gonna hit the platform, aren't we? That will make jumping easier, won't it? You're out of your mind, woman! You have a better idea? Shit. I'll see you in the crow's nest. Don't get yourself killed. <laughs> that sounds like a brilliant idea. Is everybody on board the ship mentally damaged, including me? I suppose so. Alright, fine. Well, at least I know exactly where that is, because I've already been up there. Listen, Hanson, I've got some bad news for you. Great. What is it now? We've known about that oil rig for a while. It's got some sort of radio fuzzer on it. No transmissions in or out, except in a very tight window that we can't get into. Which means? Which means that until you take care of that jamming device, I won't be able to help you. I'm heartbroken. I'm serious, <laughs> Hanson. The only way you get off that rig is if I help you. And I can't help you unless I can talk to you. So once you get on board, you smash that jammer, you got it? Sorry, you're breaking up. I can't hear you. Hansen! Hansen! Just kidding. Smash the jammer. Got it. Hansen out. Good joke, Maximilian. Good to see you have a healthy sense of humor. Because God knows you don't have a healthy brain. So, wait a minute. What ship are we jumping to? Are we jumping to another ship? Some jamming to... I'm speaking with someone remotely, so obviously, like, unjamming the radio, how is that important? Is that to be able to locate our position? I... I don't remember. Like, I don't know if they've even mentioned this, and if they have, I've forgotten it because I don't really care. I'm just assuming that the story is complete nonsense. Oh no! Enemies are surrounding me! I better slowly limp away. Gotta get rid of these bastards before meeting up with Anna. Well, that was effective. Right, so if you don't lose the bodies before they disappear, you can't get the ammo. And by the way, is she clutching her chest because I shot her? All that time ago? I think she is. I feel bad about that. Oh, hi. Look, I have to admit it's really satisfying to use the shotgun. On their faces. Oh, Jesus Christ. Son of a bitch. Yeah, uh, there we go. <laughs> right in the head. That was so perfectly lined up, the way you could see it. Aiming right at the head. Hmm. 
I guess we're about to have a high possibility of dying if they're offering this to me. No, I'm infected! What a twist! I can't imagine that would manifest itself later in the plot. Right, so what did I do? I tried to save Anna and apparently failed and then just like, crawled up like a dying fish and then just went to sleep. Okay, cool. God damn it! This shit is screaming like vision! Oh wow, I'm actually almost dead. I'm really, really close to dead. Oh. That's a bigger hole than I thought. Uh, can I climb up? I don't... Can I seriously not climb up? Like, two feet? I'm apparently in the Coast Guard. I'm pretty sure they trained us for this, don't they? I don't know. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to have to watch out. And I'm okay. Like really, that that's the puzzle is to go all the way around instead of climbing up of the climbing up the two feet to get up here? Really? Is this a door? What's it say? Dock elevator. Can I push this thing? I mean, if it's greased pretty well, maybe, maybe, yeah, probably not. Okay, where do I go? Like, is this, is this a door? Oh, apparently it was, so oh, apparently it is, okay. Go. Cool. Is this one of those slow elevator rides while waves of enemies attack you from above? Hmm. I'm suspicious. Yeah, it's one of those things, isn't it? Come on. Come on. Oh! Totally didn't call it. fire. It's raining. How could you be on fire? Alright, well apparently I didn't call it. It kind of looked like it was going to be that, but it wasn't. I'm surprised. Oh, let... No, no, go back. Don't go into that. Wait, is that steam or is that explosive? It's steam. 
And go. Now I can actually take a hit. That's nice. Sick bay. Well, I am infected. That might be a good idea. Let's try the first door, though. Ooh, that looks like an armory. Hello. Now, did that give me all types of ammo? Oh, wait, I don't even have my other weapons. Oh, I lost them. I only have my pistol. Damn. Unless I can find a new type of gun? No. This is like weapon crates. You might question the uh, the intelligence of shooting boxes with unknown contents inside of the munitions bay, but don't think about it. Don't worry. Nope. No hidden weapons. Time to go to the sick bay. Why is it asking me to save when I'm going into the sick bay? That's rather suspicious. Also, why am I going into the sick bay? I don't want to get sick, I want to get healthy. It should be called the healthy bay. Sounds ominous. Uh, I'm almost Stick. dead! I'm with Anna. You're alive. Good. There's only a little time to inject the antidote after infection. So now tell me whose life I just saved. You know Anna, yes? No. She's gone. I'm Tom Hansen, USCG. You bring terrible news. Did she tell you about this place at all? No. And yet you came here anyway. Then I must tell you. Kamsky, Anna's father, and I were sent here to study the exocells when they climbed up onto the platform. Maybe the drilling woke them up, eh? We were told to learn what they were and how to control them. But Kamsky went past that. He wanted to use them. And this is the result. It will kill us all. Where's this radio jammer I heard about? And it's Schenko had kept it in the magnetic field room. You can't get in. It has retinal scanner locks. And only an Etchenko can open it. Then I guess I'll just have to ask him to open it for me. He'll kill you first. Hansen is so dumb. He's so dumb, he doesn't understand anything. He doesn't even know what's happening, does he? This weird doctor dude, who for some reason wears sunglasses indoors like some sort of weirdo, is telling him about the reason for the infection. And then Hansen's broken brain isn't even paying attention. She's like, uh, where's the radio jammer? Completely unrelated subject, he doesn't even care. He's so... How... How are you even... How did you get to this position, Hansen? I don't get it. Am I glad to see you again? I'm not glad to see you, Hansen. You stupid fuck. I'm just kidding. I love you, Hansen. What's that say? A note about the retinal scan. 
General Order Number 22, the Magnetic Field Control Room is now off-limits to all unauthorized personnel. The new security system in place incorporates a retinal scan lock. As of this moment, only Colonel Yusupov and myself are cleared for entry. Okay, okay. Hmm, which door do I take? For this one. Damn thing's stuck. Damn it. Hansen, one more thing. Yeah. You need to. Ah! I'm sorry. What? I need to. I didn't understand that. Could you say that again? Excuse me, what what do I need to do? What do I need to do? Tell me. Tell me. What do I need to do? What do I need to do? <sighs> Here's the electronic key. Looks like a freaking network card. What the hell is that thing? Ooh, my shotgun. How convenient. All of the weapons, every single weapon I was missing is popping up. Be useful. Immediately after the plot decided I should lose them. Hmm. What is that I see out there? Ooh, look at that. Oh, I need a closer look at this. Oh, damn it, I lost my balance. Man. They really need to clean the underside of this walkway. Look at this, man. It's really been neglected. Jesus. Oh, yeah, I should probably get up. Oh my god! Oh. It was delayed for some reason. Hmm. Don't interrupt me. What did I say? Don't interrupt me. Nah, I won't do it. Okay, you got a hit off even though I blew up your head. I respect that. I respect you. Oh, shit. Go, 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 go. I'm not gonna waste ammo on those things. <laughs> you know what those are like? You know what this whole game's like? Actually, it's a bit like Martian Gothic Unification. And those little exocell things are just like the... What the hell were they called? I don't remember what they were called, but they're just like those little things that ran around on the floor. In Martian Gothic Unification, in that they... You just kind of have to run past them, and otherwise you'll just waste massive amounts of ammo on them, and they just become gigantic pains in the ass. It's unlocked. I saw you, Twitch. Preemptively do that. Yeah, okay, I hear I hear heavy breathing. That's uh, not a good sign. Oh hi. Oh, I can't move it. 
Shotgun jail, sweet. More spear gun ammo. Apparently it's inside of that guy's coat pocket. It certainly wasn't in his pants pocket because he doesn't have any pants. Because he doesn't have any lower body. Ooh, a box! I like boxes. Actually, getting a lot of ammo here. Did I check in here? Oh, hi. Oh, I missed. That time I didn't miss. Did I see something flash up there? What was that? Hm, I don't know what that was. Yeah, I still hear the heavy breathing. Ooh. What is that? A handheld grenade launcher. What's this doing here? How strange. Well, the crew members do seem to be absolutely crazy about explosives. They seem to like to blow everything up. Like, general order number 26. It seems our crew members, when getting frustrated with various objects such as malfunctioning microwaves and vending machines that don't dispense items correctly and coffee makers that don't work right, they seem to take their frustrations out on the machines by blowing them up with explosives. Please stop doing that. Thank you very much. Colonel General Admiral Anna Chenecka. What did I just do? It's opening. What's opening? What did I do? Also, I don't hear anything, so what the hell did I just do? Locked. What? Okay, apparently I can cycle something. Anyway, where's my grenade launcher? Here it is. Alright. Looks mildly effective. I have no idea what I just opened. I'm hearing a lot of heavy breathing. So either the zombies are having sex, or... a bunch of new ones have just come out. To attack me. Even know where the hell you came from. Oh god. No fair, I was getting items. Well now I gotta loot them before they disappear. I'm already losing ammo here. Yeah, I probably shouldn't get so close. Grenades. Ooh, I should have tried those. Okay, what did I just open? Do you want to save? Yes, I do. What the hell is that? That was an awkward cutscene. I thought it was going to be some epic introduction of a boss, but it was just two seconds of, what the hell is that, done. Now 
Anyway, that's a good time to end this episode here. All right. Somehow, amazingly, about three hours in, I'm actually still enjoying myself playing this completely silly and rather mediocre game. Somehow, it's actually really funny. I'm just appalled by the stupidity of everyone on board. And Mr. Maximilian Bob Jonas, whatever the hell his name is. Yeah. Oh my god. You should have never been a Coast Guard. You... I don't even know what you should have been. You shouldn't even have a job. You shouldn't be employed anywhere. You're a disgrace to the human race. Anyway, I hope you have enjoyed so far, and I will be back soon.